There is a charming tradition observed by the Adeli penguins. Once a year, during the mating season, all the male birds gather on the Antarctic beaches, and there each selects an extraordinary pebble. With pebble in hand, each male presents his precious gift to the lady he most desires. If she accepts it, they mate for life.
Of all the penguins in all the world, the most romantic was Hubie. He had a secret love in his life. Marina, the most beautiful girl penguin in the rookery. Hi, Hubie. Tell us a story. Yes, a love story. Oh, that's mushy stuff. Oh, Beanie. <laughs> well, once there was a penguin who fell in love with the most beautiful girl penguin in the whole rookery. <sighs> Did she love him back? They never even met. You see, he was painfully shy. Oh. <sighs> well, one day, he, he just swam up to her and said, Hello, Marina. I'm Hubie. And I think you're fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> Who am I kidding? I m mean, I never even t t talked to the girl. Oh! <laughs> what happened? G goodness glaciers! <laughs> Marina! So, it wasn't an avalanche. <laughs> that was some landing, Hubie. <gasps> Ouch! I'm s s s s s sorry, M Marina. I I'm just so cl clumsy. Oh, don't be silly, Hubie. <laughs> <laughs> but someone else had his eye on the fair Marina. Drake, an evil penguin who always got his way. Wimp. I'll knock the st stutter right out of him. Marina doesn't know it yet, but she's going to be my wife. Our children will be the strongest, the smartest, the bravest, not to mention the best looking. Why, they'll be just like me. Oh, I get the point. I'm telling you, boys. Marina is as good as mine. <laughs> this is quite a spot, Hubie. Oh, what do you do up here? Well, um... <clears throat> I... wonder about... S -s -s stuff? Stuff? What kind of stuff? I just... Nah, you think it was s -s -s silly. I bet it's not silly at all. Try me. Sometimes I wonder what the colors mean. Why the sea is g -g green like your eyes. Sorry. Go on. Sometimes I wonder why the moon is new, where the stars are shooting to, when they're shooting through the sky. To know, like how they make the waves and turn the tides. And then I wonder why, I wonder so, while other guys are busy choosing brides. <gasps> Where was I? Choosing brides. Sometimes I wonder if there'll ever be someone right for me, someone who may wonder too, who's wonderful. Like y y 
I don't know like you, 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 you must be bored to tears with all this wacky nonsense. Oh no, I don't think it's nonsense at all, even if you are a bit wacky. The full moon mating ceremony was fast approaching. The rookery buzzed with excitement. All the bachelors took to the beaches to find their engagement pebbles. And none was more determined than Hubie. He dove, scrambled, scrapped, and raced against the best of them. But try as he might, Hubie couldn't hold on to a single pebble. <laughs> Poor Hubie. With the day almost done and the beach picked clean of the best engagement stones, how could he ever hope to find the perfect pebble for his perfect love, Marina? Perhaps if I were to wish very, very hard. Starlight, star bright, first star I see tonight. Wish I may, wish I might. Have the wish I wish tonight. Now and forever, I'll show her I care. I'll find her the rarest stone. And maybe if the pebble is... Nobody's going to marry a loser like you. Now give me that stupid pebble. No, no, it's it's from Marina. Ha! <laughs> Hope you can swim better than you can talk. Bye, Hubie. <laughs> Sleep with the fishes. <laughs> Look what's coming our way. Hi, guys. Hey, look! The water's safe! Let's eat! Oh, boy! Hubie!
huddled against the wind and buffeted by the storm, Hubie was swept far away to warmer waters, where there lived an enemy even greater than man. Welcome back, lad. Where am I? <laughs> You're aboard the good ship Misery. You've been sleeping for nearly three days now. Three days? I've been asleep for three days? I'm sure, I'm sure Marina thinks I'm lost forever. Marina? My girl back home. Oh, why, you're our first Adebi. <laughs> what's your name? Yes, yes, what's your name? I'm... Hubie. Welcome aboard, Hubie. Although welcome probably isn't the appropriate word. Outrage! That's the appropriate word! Yes. Abomination! The Adebi! The horror. If you're into pain and agony, if you love the great indoors, welcome to the good ship misery. The misery is all yours. Every day begins with misery. Misery. Breakfast in a rusty cup. Then we all get good and miserable. And then we all grow up. The boot That door will be there later. I can promise you that. Yeah, save it, old timer. Nobody locks up Rock or the Rock Hopper. Those humans just did. <laughs> hey, when I get out of here, you're seal bait. <gasps> what are you staring at, Birdbrain? That's Hubie, and he's heartbroken. Yes, he was snatched away from the lady he oh. loved. Yeah. Poor, poor Pebblehead. If he had any guts, he never would have let them take him alive. So. 
Where is this floating scrap heap headed anyway? Our destination uh, would be uh, difficult to determine at uh, this juncture. <laughs> that means he doesn't know. Well, we be in warm waters. We be in Bora Bora Pot. I know where we are. Where do we dock? That's what I'm asking. Where do we dock? Uh, we can't say for sure, lad, but I've heard stories of sailors selling... Zeus? Zeus? I'm not going to no zoo. No, no. I'm going to the helmsman. I'll go to the first mate. I'll go all the way to the captain of this oversized dinghy. I'll make him turn this truck around if I have to. But I can't go to a zoo. I've got to get the... Back to Antarctica. Oh. Who's with me? Who's for busting out of here? Come on, you jellyfish. How about you, seal bait, you? Uh, sorry, Mr. Rocker, but the free food at this zoo sounds awful good to me. Bunch of bird brains, seal bait. Get me out of here. Give me some money. Why don't you just marry Drake? No, Priscilla. I believe Hubie's still out there somewhere, and he'll come home to me in time for the full moon mating ceremony. You? You're saying you want to marry him? I do. How could you possibly choose a wimp like Hubie over a hunk like Drake? Hubie's a sweetheart. He's generous and kind and... He's always thoughtful of others, and... Good morning, ladies. <sighs> Marina, my pet. I want you to be my mate. Drake. Drake. Ooh. I love Hubie. <laughs> Hubie? <laughs> I deeply sympathize, Marina, but since he is new where to be found, I offer my own hand. My answer is still Think no. about it. Give me your answer later. But remember, you must choose a mate before the full moon mating ceremony or be banished. <laughs> Gosh, that's the law. <laughs> I got just 10 days to get back home before the full moon ceremony. Sir! Sir! Take me with you! You talking to me? Yes, sir, I am. Don't call me sir. Call me Rocco. Rocco! Right! Yes, well, Rocco! It's about my girl! Wait, 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 wait. You want me to spring you out of this joint so you can go home to Miss Wonderful, right? Yes, yes, you're right. You see, there's another guy who's after my girl. Forget it. But a moment ago, you asked who's for busting out of here. Well, I am. You're too dumb. Take me, please. Why should I? Well, because if, 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 if the humans see me tripping all over myself, that'll divert their attention to me, giving you more time to escape. Like I really need a diversion. I could squawk and yell and make horrible noises. <gasps> oh, bother. Double bother. <laughs> <laughs> You made me laugh. Please, <laughs> I'll bring the house down. What's your name? Hubie. Well, uh, Hubie. All right, you're on. Yeah, don't worry, Hubie. But hey, once we're on deck, it's every man for himself. Yes, sir. Okay, Hubie. Here's how you're gonna break out of that cage. Now, I want you to pay attention. Watch my beak. This is all I need. Here come the boats. Okay, kid. This is it. Ahoy, mateys! Get your gullets ready for the sloppiest slop that ever graced the galley's garbage. You don't know how lucky you are, matey. No trouble from you today.
Oh, well now, that's more like it. <laughs> yeah! Judging by the heat, I'd say I'd died and went to Phoenix. Rocco, look! People! It looks like some private beach. We must be in uh, Morea or Tahiti. How do they live like this? They pay for it. I wonder how f far it is to Antarctica. 3,000 miles in that direction. But you'll never make it. I will so. I'm fit. Hey, trust me on this one. You've got eat me written all over you. I'm a good swimmer. You don't know these waters like I do, bird brain. You're right. I'm lost. Yep. You're lost, and I'm looking at a dead... Oh, bother. Yeah, I give it two days, Tops, and you'll be in the belly of anything from a killer whale to a sardine. Getting back to Marina is all that matters to me. I mean, Rocco, look. I dream about her night and day. I see her face when I close my eyes. And this, just look at this. Wow. <laughs> Is that an engagement pebble or what? Do you have to gush like that? You're probably asking yourself where I got it, right? Yes. Picture this. Pebble beach, moonlit sky, gentle breeze. Come on, come on, get to it. Suddenly, I look up and, and there it is. The first evening star. Summarize, summarize. What do I do? I make a wish. And like magic, it jets across the sky and a blaze of glory and comes to rest at my feet. <gasps> really? I pick it up and, and there, shining deep inside is... Uh-huh, uh-huh. There is the face of my own true love, Marina. So, so special, so unique, so what? Don't you see? It's my fate, uh. Rocco. I'm destined to marry Marina. It's in the stars. I'm destined to marry Marina. It's in the stars. Yep, 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 yep. Why don't you get that thing fixed, huh? Oh, I'm sorry. I, I, I guess nobody likes a blabbermouth, right? No, you think? Uh. There. Uh. I'm free of you at last. Now go away. Shoot. Adios. Boy, you're really one grumpy guy in the morning, aren't you? No, I'm grumpy all day. What happened? Did your girl run off with another? No. <laughs> She did not. Oh, then she's waiting for you, right? Hey, look, will you stop following me? You know what you need? You need a dream. I got one. What is it? Hey, I'm sure not going to tell you. Your secret's safe with me. I don't even know you. I won't laugh. Forget it. It doesn't matter how silly it sounds. Get away! I promise. Cross my heart. I won't laugh. All right, all right, all right. What? Oh, I got something. What is it? You're looking at it. I'm looking at... <laughs> yeah. 
You 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 wanna fly? Do you? <laughs> <laughs> Don't laugh, Rocco. Everybody knows. Fly? You're wrong! You are dead wrong! Our ancestors flew! <laughs> they gave us wings, but we can't fly? I mean, I mean, whose idea of a cruel joke is this? I mean, I mean, I mean, you've got to just accept it. No! No! I don't accept nothing! But, Rocco, that's the way things are. Uh -uh. I want to fly. I'm going to fly, and no one's going to stop me. I'm flying! Clap, clap, clap! Whoa! Oh, I know I twisted something. Don't laugh. <laughs> Nobody laughs at Rocco the Rock Hopper. That's funny. I, you see, I expected you to tell me something big, really stupendous, you know, like hopping up the slopes of Mount Everest or something, you know, but, but flying? Oh, for heaven's sakes, that's so easy. Says who? Waldo, that's who. Waldo? Yeah, he's... he's. Who's Waldo? He's... Waldo is this short little penguin back in my rooker. Huh? Really? Yes, really. And and listen, he claims to have gotten the hang of flying, and his wings are a lot stubbier than yours. Hey, 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 these aren't stubs. Oh, but... <laughs> there I go, being a big blabbermouth again. Wait, wait! Come back here. Thank you for helping me escape, Rocco. I've got to go, though. Wait, 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 wait. I, I must be back before the next full moon. Marina needs me. Goodbye. Wait, wait, that, you're lost. That, that, that way's north. Oh, I, I just, I just remembered something. I think Waldo said the secret of flying was wind speed. Well, anyway. Uh, wind speed? Off I go. That, you know, that's, that's right. That's exactly what I think. That's what I've been working on. That's my theory. Wind speed, see? You know, that's amazing that there's a, someone else knows about that. Well, come here, what, what else did Waldo say? Can we can we swim as we talk? Marina's waiting. Yeah, sure, why, why not? Uh, I got a couple of days anyway. Which way is south? Uh, that way. I want to meet this Waldo character. Waldo? You get me and Waldo together, and I'll get you to the Antarctic by the next full moon. Oh, I, I like the sound of that. Well, there's only eight days left before the full moon. Mating ceremony, and Marina still won't agree to be my mate. Although, my faithful servants, we have seen that Hubie. Meal. <laughs> it's a pleasant thought that that stupid little will never return. Marina is mine. Remember teamwork in about ego. About me go. Cricky. So, what happens if you don't make it on time? Oh, that's too horrible to even think about. Well, think about it. Who would Marina marry? Drake. Drake? Well, is he any good to the ladies? Yeah. Well, Captain, full speed ahead! Here we go! Five days left, Rocco. We're running out of time. Look, we can't swim in this storm. Unless you want to die. Maybe Drake will leave Marina alone. I mean, yeah, well, maybe Drake has already married Marina. No, no. I know my girl. She'll wait. Uh... And if she accepts this pebble, we'll be married. If she accepts the pebble? You mean you're not sure if she's going to accept the pebble? You mean you're going through all this trouble and you're not even sure? She'll accept it. Oh, come on! It's <laughs> beautiful. It's... <gasps> it's perfect. Yes, it is perfect, isn't it, Rocco? There. That ledge. 
Baco? We have discovered an authentic ancient aviarial airstrip. What? This is beautiful. This is it. You're not going to try to fly again, are you? Oh, you bigger kill feathers I am. Rocco! Can't fly! Ooh, feel that wind. R Rocco! Oh, where's your sense of adventure? <laughs> this is a chance of a lifetime! This is the end of a lifetime. Wind speed, perfect. Altitude, perfect. Tail feathers, perfect. Rocco, Wind. don't! Span! You're gonna Wind. Kill, kill yourself! Airlift! He'll be watching the fly in a plane! Yes! yes. <laughs> oh. Wind speed, wind speed. Not on wind speed. Oh, 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 I know I twisted something. I, oh. Rocco, are you all right? Rocco! Get away from me. But I, I just... Don't touch me, just get away. I was just trying to... I don't need any help, just get away from me now. Fine. S suit yourself. I will. Just keep going. Go back to little green eyes. Or whatever her name is. Well, maybe I will. Yeah, go. See how long you last in your own. Shoot me. Huh? No! Huh? <laughs> no, I mean, no, uh, wait. Uh... So you d decided to apologize, huh? Well, then I... Don't be stupid. I don't apologize to anybody. Look. <gasps> that pebble brain is a killer whale. The meanest killing machine in these waters. Goodness glaciers. You saved my life. Oh, no. Come on, don't get all whiny about it. Just go, 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 go play with your pebble. It's no big deal. Just go, go. No, Leave me alone. No, I'm serious. I could have been killed. <sighs> I'm starting to wish you had. Just go, will you? Can't you even admit that you like me just a little? What? I don't like you. I hate you. I just happen to hate kill whales a little bit more than you, that's all. Is that so? Yeah. Well, then... Fine. Fine is right. When the whale leaves, we'll just go our separate ways then. Yeah, well, sounds good to me. I don't need to be seen with. Hey, what is that? Who is it? Who's that? What are you doing? Who? Ah, oh, get your own shelter. I was here first. So I'm here second. So what? Move! So, Marina, when should I announce our engagement? Today, tomorrow, Wednesday? Drake, <laughs> I wouldn't marry you if you were the last on Earth. Don't worry. I'll make it official with the obligatory pebble and all that. The answer is no! No? No? Oh, I get it. You're joking. <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? Don't make me laugh. <laughs> don't make me laugh. <laughs> My funny friend, don't make me bend in half. Don't be a card, babe. Don't mess with trick. Don't make me laugh so hard. That you begin to ache Don't make me laugh <laughs> Don't pull my leg <laughs> May I suggest you would do best to beg If you say no, miss If you refuse This is your notice That I refuse to lose Don't make me laugh <laughs> Or slap my knee 
better than a killer whale. It's our first sight of home. We're almost there. Look, it, it's all right if, if you want to split up. I understand. No hard feelings. That's probably for the best. Hey, well, give my regards to Waldo. Waldo? Waldo. Oh, yeah, I sure will. I... Rocco, there's something you should know. Waldo... Waldo isn't real. Say what? I needed you to, to show me the way home. I, I didn't think you'd do it if I just asked, so I... So I made up stories about a make-believe guy named Waldo. You lied to me? You dumb nerd. Rocco, stop! I could have been back in Tahiti with those people on the beach. I'm sorry! Feeding me because I was a cute little... I'm sorry. Oh. No, you. You decided to lie to me. Oh, come to on. To drag me through 3,000 miles of water and killer whales. Me, you stink. You are a Come here. Come here with that beak. Come here. Down near the South Pole, please look me up. <laughs> in four days, Berberine, I'll be in Antarctica. Where will you be? Huh? Rocco! Come on, try to keep up! Great! Looks like I got me a new student. You know anything about fighting? Well, how do you handle pain? What? Oh, just kidding. How about blood?
Sometimes I wonder if you're still alive. How could you survive such a dangerous world out there? Beware, my love. Take care, my love. Take Rocco, I don't think I can walk. Hey, how big is this Drake guy? I could have a broken bone. You're gonna have to uh -oh. fight him. I'm what? You have to put Drake in his place. Well, I I'm not a fighter. I'll teach you. I've never hit anyone. Look, the first thing you need to know about winning is how to bluff. Rocco, I can't. I do you love the girl? Of course I do. I then shut up. Now let's see your war face. Like this? <laughs> oh, I think my bunny slippers just ran for cover. Come on. Like this. <laughs> oh! Well, you know what? That's fantastic. It's a bluff. I'm tougher than any bird. Well, I'm tougher than any polar bear. Why, well, I'm hungry. What do we have here? It looks like a fishing hole. Do you think it's safe? I'm too hungry to care if it's safe or not. Let's go. How much farther to the Antarctic? I don't know. Could be a few miles. Could be a few days. Who cares? Come on. A few days? I, I, I don't think I could wait that long. So, you want to go first? What? Oh, uh, well, if, if you're not brave enough... Hey, who says I'm not brave enough? Then I'll go. I'm brave enough? Come on, let's go. One, two, three. Belly dragger? That wasn't food, that was a log! I thought it tasted funny. Amazing? M me? What? No, no, I didn't say that. Oh, yes, you did. I heard you. No, 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 I didn't say that. No, 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 no. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. I didn't say nothing like you that. You do like m me. I don't like anybody. Oh, yes, you d d do. <laughs> and I knew it all along. Get away from me. <laughs> hey, Rocco. I g guess this means we put our differences on ice. Huh? Put our differences on ice? I'd like to put you on ice. <laughs> Look how we get along together. I think 
It's great the way we when you've tried to be as tough as leather. But now I see that's just pretend. We'll find our way through stormy weather. Just you and me right to the end. Hey, your body looks like we're two birds of a feather. And GM looks like I got me a friend. Now you go. Take it, Rocco. Hey, Rocco, what do you call a flower before it opens? What? What do you call a flower before it opens? A bud. I love it when you call me bud. Look how we get along together. You're incredibly annoying. I think it's the way we You're like a blend. bone stuck in my throat. You've tried to be as tough as leather. This isn't something I'm enjoying. But now I see that's just pretend. I should have left you on that boat. We'll find our way through stormy weather. You want a friend, go find a snail. Just you and me right to the end. Or better hey, yet, yeah, I kill a whale. like we're two birds of a feather. Don't call me funny. And you look like uh, I got me me. a friend. Now you try. Take it, Rocco. Hey, Rocco, I caught you a herring. Where should I put it? What? I caught you a herring. Well, where should I put it? Put it there. Put it there. All right. Oh, stop it. <laughs> when you're a rebel, you're a rebel. You don't like me, just admit it. You don't know it. finding friends to like. All right, I'm going to hold my breath. Why don't you pack your blasted pebble? Admit it. Admit and it. And take yourself a healthy hike. You know you're going to cost my death. They don't have penguins up in Juno. It's getting dark. Why don't you go and start a trend? Goodbye, Rocco! I'll knock it off! Hey! Hey, you're all blue! Breathe, you bird brain! Kill me! Say it! All right, then. I kinda, sorta, maybe, you know. You mean you like me? A little. You mean it? Don't push it off! Showed him. We? Oh, come on, you're a terrible fighter. As they continued their journey home, Rocco was determined to teach Hubie that it wasn't enough simply being in love with Marina. The time would come when he would have to fight for her. But with Drake as his opponent, would he be up to the challenge? In the call. Come on. Goodness gracious, what was that? It looked like a killer whale. It was bigger than hell. Twice as big, twice as fast, and twice as mean. Oh, good. But that's not the worst part. Wonderful. What's the worst part? Killer whales always travel in groups. What? Groups. Oh, no. Big groups. Lots. Oodles and oodles. <laughs> See that iceberg? What iceberg? That one! Swim for it! Swim! Well, we could fly! My pebble! Pebble, your pebble! My Forget pebble. about the black!
blasted Pebble. I don't want to hear Pebble from you. Wake up! Oh, 
hurry! Hubie, you must save Marina! Uh, wake up, Hubie! Uh, Come on, Hubie, you can do it! Come 3,000 miles and lose my best buddy to be stopped by the likes of you! Drake! Come on! Take your best shot! You get the far, we'll do the rest. Oh! Punch and blow. Stay out of this, you mangy fools. Yeah, yeah, you must be annihilated. <laughs> yeah, yeah, put his back in whiskers. <laughs> He's a blooming pussycat, he is. Look behind you, chum. <laughs> Hey, Romeo! Rocco? Goodness glaciers! Rocco! Oh, 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 sorry. I can't believe you're alive! Say your prayers, you fool! My best friend, Rocco. <laughs> Rocco Marina. The flying Rocco. Pleased, I'm sure. Hey, 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 Hubie. You forgot your blasted pebble. My pebble? My pebble, Rocco, you found it. Don't just stand there, Romeo. Give the girl the pebble. You like it? I love it. You better. Good. But don't you know? It's not the pebble. I love you even more. So Hubie and Marina proved that neither distance nor danger can stand in the way of true love. You need only follow your heart. And goodness glaciers, they lived happily ever after. <laughs>